all right guys um so yeah that was it for the uh blitz and uh i got a little bit of gold there from that recent uh couple of uh, orbs opening but yeah without further ado uh let's uh oh yeah right uh, so yeah again just more uh or more uh orbs for my uh ultimus uh perfect uh yeah so let's get right into it i'm gonna quickly just open up my star force orbs because again uh I've been kind of meaning to save these. I'm just I'm just lazy. I haven't really been opening stuff as I should be, but that's okay. Um, and I've already unlocked uh, I've already unlocked uh, Mini Orva, but yeah, she is absolutely awesome. I haven't leveled her up yet since I'm pretty uh, pretty tight on gold right now, especially with everything that's going on. And again, just a couple more times there. Um, yeah, and I'm hopeful. Hopefully, uh, after this, we can uh, we can uh, get a couple more. Perfect. Yeah, and I know. Um, Purple would be awesome right now. Uh, yeah, let's see here. What else do we got here? Yeah, just greens. Greens all day. Oh my gosh, my luck has been crap. All right. Oh, Thanos. Yeah, or no, um, not Thanos, sorry. Uh, perfect. Well, okay, that's it. So we got, uh, whoops. Let's see here. So 60 wasn't bad. Uh, and then we got a couple of Ronins, and then we got a couple of uh, uh, Korathes as well. So perfect. Okay, so let's get right to it. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to quickly open up my premium orbs, and then we'll proceed with trying to see if we can search and find that seven-star Captain Marvel. Um, so all right. So again, I've been saving up these orbs, uh, pretty much hoping for an event or something. And again, uh, I was hoping that they would uh, release more uh, events as we go here. But again, this kind of ties in well with one of the milestones that they've recently um, uh, unlocked here. Uh, basically, when we open up a orb, we basically get points for the alliance, and it goes towards uh, the uh, the uh, basically the new alliance wars that's basically coming here. So yeah, so that kind of works out. We're still progressing along here, and obviously it'd be great if we can get to those orange elite orbs. But again, we'll see how it goes. All right. So we'll go back to premium orbs, and we will start doing the dance, guys. All right, wish me some luck here, and we will see what we can pull. So garbage. Come on, give us some purples. Okay. And, hey, I'll take Sabretooth. Again, that's great. Um, I need to still work on my teams for Magneto, so that's great. Um some gold. Gold's always great to have. So again, I'm just hoping we get uh, some better pulls here. And again, like I said, I've been saving up a lot of these orbs uh, in anticipation for something like uh, maybe additional heroes being added to the mix. Uh, but again, I figured with the uh, Captain Marvel Red Stars opening, I figured I might as well just jumbo in these premium orbs in there as well. So and again, Groot, perfect. Not two shabs right now. I just hope we get a couple oranges, or I mean not oranges, a couple purple orbs would be awesome. And anything relating to the uh, any of the mutants right now for uh, for the Magneto event, that would be awesome. Because again, uh, they pretty much made it so you have to get it through premium orbs. And uh, unless you're just farming Wolverine or, or you're farming Mystique, otherwise Sabretooth and Pyro, I mean, you can't get them unless... Uh, you're spending money into the game. Um, Thanos is always great to have. Again, oh, perfect. I, I do like Iron Fist, so that's good. Extras, extras for my uh, Ultimus, perfect. Again, more Kree. That's great for Nick Fury in the upcoming event that's coming up here in the next five days or so. Uh, basically, you need all the Kree minions unlocked to get uh, the seven-star Nick Fury. And if you haven't already been playing those... Nick Fury and the S.H.I.E.L.D. teams, they're absolutely OP, and uh, pretty much uh, the go-to team right now, as it's the, pretty much a great offensive and defensive team, um, You can it's great for defending in the arenas, and then it's also great for the Blitz, uh, especially when you're up against the Tier 8 multipliers. Perfect, let's see what we got going on here, more Kree, hey, that's not bad, again, let's see what we got going on here, still nothing, nothing, Nothing super duper pulling, like uh, appealing. Sorry. So we'll just keep popping here. See how she goes. Again, just more garbage. Yeah. See, I was hoping I'd get more X, uh, X Men slash mutants, but 
yeah it's just you guys will find that these premium orbs i feel like with more uh more added characters that they've added to the game it just seems like there's so much more trash that they've also added as well drop rates don't feel as good as they were initially since the release and i know a lot of youtubers and other uh, players out there right now too are kind of voicing their concerns on that uh, yeah more garbage and i haven't even been farming any of the aims or the hydras because again um, just everything you do, I mean, uh, whether it be Blitz, whether it be uh, uh, randomly uh, getting orbs from premium, it just seems like they always find a way to, you know, they always find a way to drop. So, see, see, uh, there you have it again. <laughs> All right, so, that's great. At least Venom's great because uh, I can always use more Venom. And again, still just greens all around. Yep, and Wolverine. We'll see how she goes. Just a lot of greens, you guys. Yeah, nothing exciting. Nothing exciting. You know, Thanos was always great to have, too, because, again, for those of you that haven't seven-starred him, just great to have. So, again, more trash. And I've actually lost count now, but we'll just, we'll just keep going until we uh, see that we have to use... Uh, uh, premium orbs or uh, uh, power cores then we'll know and there you guys have it so we'll just go through the uh, we'll just go through the list here and yeah just um, not too much nothing crazy to brag about I think the best thing was probably getting a couple mutants involved and obviously the uh, the pyro and the saber tooth is a nice touch uh, um, Wolverine eh, very maxed him out and just a whole bunch of mats and crappy characters but yep that's it you guys that's it for the premium arms all right let's get down to the fun stuff so um yeah and then i've also got uh let's see here i think i had some yeah i got some mega orbs open too at the end here for you guys but again yeah let's try our luck i'm hoping i can at least unlock something with captain marvel because again i think everyone's kind of racing and trying to see if they can two two star four star or six or seven star red star her and again everyone's super excited for uh, for this new character. So let's see how we do. So we got Hulk. I already got him. Oh, there we go. All right, perfect. Well, that's great. Gets that out of the way, and then I don't have to worry about it. All right, so three-starred her right there. Perfect. And again, a good strategy would be to um, to save your orbs, especially with the upcoming events that are coming up. So right now, like... Uh, Oh, there you go, uh, with uh, Killmonger, and especially with the other Wakanda uh, players being unlocked, characters being unlocked here in the upcoming update. So that'll be super-duper exciting for a lot of us here. Um, oh, that's great. I only had a two-star one. That's awesome. Oh, perfect. Wow, I'm unlocking... Uh, ah, better, it's, these are be definitely better poses than the premium orb, so I'm happy about that. So again... And again, duplicates are nice, especially when we can get the elite red star. So I'm not going to complain there. Just that potential, you know. You always wish you could either get a, 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 a four star or higher, especially with red orbs. Uh, again, Wakanda, perfect. Well, hey, I'm happy with that. It's at least it's something. And again, just a little bit garbage there. Um... Okay. Oh, Mystique. All right, come on. Oh, not bad at all either. Uh, oh, well, there you have it, eh? Okay, wow. Well, I was hoping at least to get a four or five, but like I said, it's it's all going to depend on luck here. Again, another dupe. And as you unlock more characters, you're going to realize, holy crap, there's a lot of dupes. But that's okay, like I said, they do craft it into the game mechanics so that that way it goes towards uh, the elite, elite red stars and then you can kind of work towards getting something that's guaranteed to be at least a four star. So, All right, and just a couple more here it looks like, guys. So this video will be briefly done here and I'll just quickly uh, open up my um, my mega orbs as well for you guys here. 
Yeah, again, more garbage. Oh, well, that's nice. At least I got a four star out of this. So that's great. Perfect. Okay, guys, so we are done there. So awesome, like I said already. Uh, um, I'll just quickly look at our roster here and uh, see which one's being locked. So I did get quite a few, which is uh, pretty awesome. And like I said, I'm just happy that I got, I was able to get uh, Captain Marv out of it. Again, three star. Right now I've got her at 50 out of 100, and I'm about halfway there. But like I said, you, I've been um, trying not to use too much of my power cores to get her. But again, you'll find it almost incredibly impossible um, without spending money to get all those milestones done. And even today, I mean, I've only spent pretty much 100,000 uh, gold already on her so i mean yeah just to get that 1.8 mil is incredibly difficult so i've been i've been trying to aim for the uh 1.2 uh milestones because then you can at least get a three of her and then obviously um just the extra six hundred thousand to me isn't worth it and again i mean you're going to get her well unlocked already especially with how long the event runs for her. so i mean don't be too worried about that and again these are just all our extra character shards that we got out of the mix there. And again, gave us 5,000 Ultimus Orbs. So, hey, I'm not complaining. I'm stockpiling my Ultimus Orbs as well in case they add more to the mix. So I won't open those today. Um, but yeah, let's take a look at this Elite Red Star. And I'm hoping, I'm hoping, because of the double chances, according to Foxnet, that we can uh, have a higher chance of getting Captain Marvel. So who knows? Oh, darn. Okay, well, it's better than nothing, but... I'm just glad I, uh, I didn't get a crappy minion or something. <laughs> All right. Perfect. So we are just going to open up our uh, Mega Orbs. And then we are done, guys. We, are, we will be done after this. So let's see what we get. Purple. Oh, okay. And I remaxed her out, so that's unfortunate. But let's try again. And Hawkeye already maxed out as well. So, again, um, just more... Just more uh, ores for my ultimus, I guess. But hey, it's all it's all good. It's fine. Um, I'm glad I at least got heroes instead of minions. But uh, yeah, so that's it, guys. That's it for my opening, and uh, hopefully you guys liked it. Uh, nothing, um, like I said, nothing crazy about the uh, openings. But uh, yeah, uh, better luck next time for myself, I guess. But just goes to show you, even if you pour uh, quite a bit of money into the game with those orbs, I mean, your luck will still be crap. So I mean, uh, definitely. Uh, definitely something to think about, right? Especially down the uh, down the road here uh, when you're playing a free-to-play game. But yeah, thank you for uh, watching, you guys. Um, please like or subscribe if you haven't already. Otherwise, I uh, hope you guys have a fantastic day and uh, stay tuned for more videos.